Hi, this is uh, Bill in Prague, and uh, I got my HTC 7501 a few weeks ago, and I'm learning more about it every day. It's not something uh, that you want to just jump into. It's, uh, there's quite a learning curve. Unfortunately, I had a QTEC 9000, which was based on the Windows Mobile 5 platform. And I have to say that Windows Mobile 6 is much, much better. I have a blog on the 7501 that I'm adding to from time to time. It's htc7501.blogspot.com. And uh, please take a look and send me any comments or corrections that you might have. What uh, today's blog is about is uh, closing programs on the 7501. I've had a few crashes on the 7501, and I had many, many crashes on the QTEC 9000, which was really its predecessor. And um, mostly, or many, many times, they're caused by too many programs open in the background. And what you want to do is not have a lot of programs running in the background. So you need to close all excess programs. And it's, uh, well, it's kind of easy to tell. I have installed on the phone the uh, SPB Mobile Shell, which is the top layer there, and the SPB Pocket Plus. I don't really think I could live without these two programs. They're just wonderful. So this is the uh, Pocket Plus screen, and I've chosen to put uh, several programs and uh, uh, warning items or system items on this screen so I can quickly access them. I can see that my battery is right at 100%. So I'll just click here, which is the processor, and it comes up and it tells me what programs are running. And uh, File Explorer, ActiveSync, Contacts, and Internet Explorer. Now I can actually click on one of those and go to it, or I can stop it, or I can stop them all. Of course, I don't want to stop ActiveSync because uh, I happen to be on ActiveSync. So let's just go to Contacts, and there we are. Now the button here can be programmed to do many things. Uh, through eight, uh, SPB Pocket Plus. And right now, I've just got it programmed to minimize. So it will minimize uh, the contacts, but it hasn't closed them. All right, now let's go back into the uh, settings, the drop down menu, go to System. And we'll scroll down here. Some of the nifty things about Pocket Plus, and there's the SPP Pocket Plus icon. I'll just open that. And the close button. So I've already highlighted that. We'll go to what uh, the features do, and I've just got it programmed to minimize. So I can also select close, close all, Close all inactive. Go to the Today screen. Running programs. Let's see what options does. Soft reset. You'll use the soft reset a lot. And suspend. Now there's a lot of other options on there. Backlight up, backlight down, backlight loop, volume up, volume down. But there are plenty of buttons to do all of that uh, on uh, the HTC. So I'm not going to include those. I will minimize that. Dun, dun, dun. Minimize that. Now it's got everything on there. Let's just do this again. Drop down menu. Now you see I have all of these other things on there. So I can close this program. Close all, close all inactive, or go to the Today screen. Or here are the individual programs that are open, and I can close them from here. Or I can do a soft reset, or turn the device off. Isn't that fantastic? So we'll just go to 
the Today screen, and you can see that works. I'll do another soft, uh, another drop down. Open up Google Maps. That's a very uh, processor intensive uh, application. Click OK. And there we have uh, Google Map actually showing where I live in Prague in the Czech Republic. And it's loading, 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 connecting, loading. Probably won't connect because of the uh, connection here. So now let's hope this works. Hit the X button. Boy, I picked a bad example, didn't I? I think it's going to have to load everything. Now we hit the X button. What does it say? There we go. So, we'll close Google Maps. There we go. Now we'll go back over here and check. Running programs. And as you can see, Google Maps is not running in the background. Always keep an eye on what's running in the background, folks, or you will have a device crash. So I'll close that. Let's find another program. Ah, what else is open? Well, let's go to the, we can tell from here. Word Mobile. All right. So there is a uh, Word document, which happens to be a newspaper story, which I've downloaded. So now I will click this and just again, have to hold it. Click and hold. I will close. Yep. Close all. Now, just to be sure that it did it, let's check the running programs. And only Active Sync is running because I have to have Active Sync running or I wouldn't be able to do this recording. So that's it. Remember, keep as many programs closed as possible. I mean, don't have a lot of stuff running in the background that you're not using because this is not a full laptop. It's a wonderful, wonderful device but keep it clean, folks. I'll be back with more tips. I think I'll uh, do how to set up an email account because I've seen a lot of questions on that, and that'll probably be the next video I do.